What's up guys, my name is Hydrus and welcome to some Koro Koro information regarding Zygarde forms, possibly the new Pokemon game, and also maybe some Greninja alternate forms or possibly a fusion, we don't know, but let's go ahead and get to the information that was leaked from Koro Koro. So some of the images that you're going to see on screen is just from the first couple leaks of Koro Koro regarding Zygarde's new forms. Now, Zygarde can... Uh, in this leak can take many forms. We all know Zygarde's natural form, which is Zygarde, which in this it stated that the Zygarde that we all know and love from Pokemon X and Y, its form is called normal Zygarde at 50% and is called Zygarde 50% form. And there is a couple other forms. We all saw the blob in the previous leaks. We saw the blob that everyone was guessing that was maybe like a, like a little Zygarde running around. I don't know. But that thing is going to be called Zygarde Core. And it's the, the blob cell, and they call it Zygarde Core, and it becomes the brain of every form. So... Possibly, maybe we can have more than one? Who knows? Maybe maybe we can have more than one. That'd be pretty cool. But, uh, the other forms are Zygarde 10% form, which is like a dog form, and its form has sharp teeth and speed that it says in the leak, and that is pretty cool. It's, I, I assume it's going to be kind of like maybe Deoxys speed, in a, in a sense, that 10% form is the fast, speedy, uh, speedy form that it has. Possibly its normal form is its base form that just has, you know, its basic stats. The blob form is its weakest and most vulnerable, kind of like the, the first, uh, the first basic form of a Pokemon, I would say, I would say. Possibly, we don't know. But... It has, according to this, it has Zygarde Core, 10%, uh, 50%, and then Perfect Form, or I guess 100% Form. And that's four forms for one Pokemon. We, we all know the first form, we all know the first one that we all know and love, the 50% form, like I said. We all know we, ha we have that one, but three more, like I said, the Core, the 10%, and then the uh, Perfect Form. The new, the new large one that we're all wondering about is called its perfect form, and it retains dragon ground type. And that is, I mean, I like that it retains the, the, the typing and stuff like that, but this thing is a beast looking. I mean, the way they state it, that it's perfect form, it's kind of like Dragon Ball Z references in a sense, because perfect form, we had cell perfect form from Dragon Ball Z, and then we have, uh, we have Zygarde perfect form, so cell, Zygarde, maybe they're you know, maybe they're cousins in different universes, we don't know. Maybe Zygarde is the Cell of the Pokemon universe, and then Cell is obviously in the DBZ universe, I don't know. That's all good fun. But Zygarde, as you guys can see, its left side is blue, and its right side has red on it. I don't think it will be at all... I don't think it's a fusion, it's, it's a form, obviously, so no fusion in for this. I don't think that fusion ever will exist for Zygarde, because it states that it's a form. That's just my opinion, and that's what I'm going off of. So, it has the right side for red and the, the uh, left side for blue. Now, what I'm thinking is that when it learns Thousand Arrows and Thousand Waves, uh, it, use, it uses the animation for its blue side to do Thousand Waves, and then Thousand Arrows comes from the red side, if that makes sense, because... That means uh, Thousand Arrows was meant to counter Yveltal, and Thousand Waves was meant to counter Xerneas. So, I figure, you know, the blue side stands for Xerneas, and the red side is for Yveltal, since Xerneas is blue and Yveltal is red. And that they have di the two animations concur with uh, the, the siding that it has. So, the blue side is for, you know, like I said, Xerneas, and the red side is for Yveltal, depending on which Thousand moves that it uses against the Pokemon. But, that's just a speculation, that's what I think it is. And also in the center of Zygarde, it has like, what Dusk Noir has. Like, if you look at Dusk Noir's body, it has like that smiley face on the front and the back. That's what Zygarde's front looks like. It has like, the blue and red smiley face. And then in the center, it's white. It's white in the center. I want to know maybe if there's a special thing that has to go on with the white in the middle. But... We don't know yet. That's we haven't had much uh, that go off of off of this, so that's gonna be pretty cool. And in the bottom corner, in the bottom corner of this leak, there's a new kind of Greninja form. Now everyone was saying uh, when this leak came out that it was possibly Mega Greninja, but after further like kind of investigation, it's it's translated to English. It says Ashy Greninja, and to me, it looks like Ash was fused with Greninja, or that they tag team up. And kind of, I guess, share body, a uh, share a body, and 
tag team or something. Mainly, I it's it seems like a fusion in my opinion. That's what it seems like to me. So that's what I'm gonna think I'm gonna go off of is a fusion based of Greninja and Ash, and that's what's going on. Greninja and Ash tag team up. They do some sort of technique to where Ash and Greninja can tag team into one body and work together. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, either it's a fusion, maybe something to do with Aura. I, I really have no idea. That's just all what I'm going off of. But uh, Greninja looks pretty cool. I kind of like that look of Greninja. It's got like the black, the red, and the blue. It's obviously just a standard Greninja, just a little bit altered. And it, lo- it does look pretty cool. I think, it, I think it's a good form. And I want to know what they're going to be doing with this form and what it's going to be playing as in the movie. Now... The final thing that I want to talk about is that this this little uh, Koro Koro leak says that uh, the new anime series is going to be called Pokemon XY and Z, and it's to come with the Mega Evolution Act 4 starting October 29th. So, possibly, <laughs> possibly the new game is confirmed to be Z, because in my opinion, that's the only thing that makes sense. I know XZYZ, X2Y2, those things make sense too. But with the way Pokemon was, I think Z is the mo- is the one that makes the most sense to me because X Y the third one has to be Z. That's just how I see it. That's the way I've always thought it. I've really never cared for the X two Y two or X Y X Z Y Z. I never really cared too much for those names. It didn't really stick. It didn't really feel like it was a great name for a Pokemon game. I mean, Pokemon X Y and then Z. You know. Come on. I mean, those are just those are just letters, but I mean, still Z makes more sense in the sequence of X, Y, Z, because that's, you know, I guess what it is in the alphabet. So it makes more sense. But uh, in, in the like I said, it does uh, the new anime series is going to be Pokemon X, Y and Z and is to come with the Mega Evolution Act 4 starting on October 29th. So that's going to be interesting that Pokemon has been changed to Pokemon X, Y and Z. That's going to be pretty cool, and the uh, Zygarde form, the perfect form, I forgot to mention that, in the po- in the system Pokemon, it is uh, 4.5 meters tall and 610 kilograms, and it is said to exceed Xerneas and Yveltal in power, so, obviously this thing was meant to take on Yveltal and Xerneas, obviously in its uh, 50% form, which is the form from X, Y, X and Y, that it wasn't able to really counteract Yveltal and Xerneas because it wasn't at full power. It was at 50% power, and perfect form is its 100% power. So, once more uh, information comes out, I will do more videos for you guys. Let me know what you guys think of this video down in the comments down below and what you guys think of the new Zygarde forms. Please let me know down in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure to leave a like on your way out for the new leaks of Korokoro regarding Pokemon X, Y, and Z, and the new Zygarde forms, and what is said to be known as Ashy Greninja, or what sort of looks like Greninja in Ash's clothes, or something like that. But, we don't know what this new thing is. Uh, Maybe it's a, a fusion of Ash and Greninja. Let me know what you guys think of that as well down in the comments down below, and also what you guys think that each of the forms of Zygarde have to play. So the Blob, which is uh, Zygarde Core, the 50% form, which is known as Zygarde 50% form, uh, Dog, the Dog form, which is at 10%, and it's called Zygarde 10% form, and then the big large form that you guys see is Zygarde Perfect form. Now. Let me just state that my opinion on how this works is that when Zygarde is at 100% health, um, Zygarde is at that perfect form. As his health goes down when he hits the certain percentages, he reverts to his forms. Now, I could be completely wrong on that, but that's just what I kind of think it is because 10%, 50%, you know, it kind of makes, I I mean, it seems like it's going off health percentage, I guess, but I don't know. Maybe it has to do with something else. We'll see. But once more information does come out, I will put more videos out for you guys to enjoy. But make sure you guys hit that like button down below so we can get to 25 likes. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a fantastic day.